Hello everybody, today we are out here at George Poston Park and I'm just going to do a quick rundown on my whole Thai Vol build. I haven't done like a full breakdown since I started building it, I've been playing around with it, doing different things, playing around, seeing what works, what doesn't work. So I'll give it a quick breakdown. So straight from the top, I have um, ODI Elite Grips. Magura MT Trail Sport brake calipers and levers. It's four piston front, two piston rear. I changed the lever to the two finger style lever. I feel it gives it a lot more of a SRAM modulation, much better than the Magura ones that come stock. Drivetrain is actually a Micro Shift Advent X. If you guys have seen any of my videos, I honestly love this drivetrain. For the price, you cannot beat it. Um, I also got over here my dropper post I'm using a wolf tooth lever light action connected to a Fox transfer 100 millimeter dropper post with a specialized power saddle um, I also have a Ragley 40 millimeter 40 millimeter stem Crank Creek 40 headset King Creek whoa um, Rock Shocks Pike set up at 140 mil of travel with um, a push ACS3 conversion so it's converted to coil I love how it feels it feels very very nice um, crank set is a 30 30 tooth SRAM circle uh, round oval chain ring no it's just a round chain ring uh, 165 cranks and the previous owner of this frame told me that he had 175 cranks and he didn't like how much it bottomed out so I really went and looked for 165 cranks. Almost no pedal strikes on this bike. Considerably how long the bottom bracket is and how long the chain stays are, I rarely ever get pedal strikes. And then these are my mallet pedals, love them, run them on almost everything. Wheels are a custom built set of um, Hope Pro 4 hubs with Race Face Arc 40 rims. And in the front, I'm running a Maxxis DHF 29 by 2.5. And in the rear, a DHR2 with um, 29 by 2.4. Um, honestly, I really like the tan wall. I'm not gonna lie. The tan wall was mostly of the reason why I got it in the first place. But um, besides the looker, it definitely does grip when I take it to Beach Mountain and take it to park, bike parks. It definitely does the job. And last but not least, water bottle cage. Got the fit lock. Um, people say it's expensive, but if you function in the price of a water bottle on a good cage, by the time you lose a water bottle once, you already paid off a fidlock. So consider that you never lose it, you'll never have to worry about it. Um, yeah, and if you guys have any questions, please feel free to let me know in the comments and enjoy.